Okay, we are here at Woodruff playing the shorts. That is Cinco de Mayo. So, loser has to buy some tacos and margaritas. Ooh. Nice kick. Oh. Yeah, no. Go put. Okay, it's tied up at neg one. Going into hole two, 236 feet. So we'll see what he can do. Oh. In here, he's got an open look. I heard pull. Lays it. Okay. 10 footer, 12 footer. There we go. Mine landed right there. Okay. Still tied up. Going into hole three. 289 feet. Somewhere around to the left of this bend. She ended up in that tall grass next to that tree. Oh no. I'll join you. Okay, if you follow along, you know my weakest part of my game is a standstill. Okay. You'll be inside the circle. She's a little bit in front of me. Follow along, you know that standstills are my strength. Yeah. Nice spot. Basket is down there. We are driving from up here. Okay, she went over there. We'll see. Yeah. Nice. Okay. She is currently leading Nag One to even. I got a bogey in that last hole. This is a pretty cool hole. Pretty high elevation. It's 190 feet, but it's way up there. What got up there? Oh my god, I thought he was gonna... Oh, that's about where mine hit. We got some tap-ins right here. There we go. Nice. Two parts. Hole six, she's currently winning by one. 
That should be all right. Nice little treat cake. Okay, so I don't normally do this, uh, but we have a discount with our guy Keith, and he likes to forehand and make it come in this way. I'm gonna try it. Might backfire, it might not. Okay, shout out Keith, love you, You're my brother. Wow. I think that's actually gonna be pretty good. We'll see. Oof. Well, we missed our birdie putts, but there's always next time. Love you, Keith. Okay, so we're on hole seven, 261 feet. She, Emily is currently nag one, and I am even. This is a nice tunnel shot. There's the basket. We'll see what happens. This will make or break this round, guaranteed. And she goes, goes, goes. Great line. That's a lace. Okay, my goal is not to hit the first available, so maybe second available. It's also a lace. Not bad. Mm. It's not a gimme, but we'll see. We got a tie going into hole eight. Um, last hole, I stepped on a stick and it jumped up and hit me in my, uh, yeah, so that kind of hurt. I might be on IR the rest of the round. We'll Apparently see. Apparently it didn't affect you because you just got a birdie. Yeah, well, it might affect my drives. I don't know. All right, the basket's down there and he's teeing off from up here. I think it was like 282. Oh, that should be all right. Pitch up, run. Although he does run everything, so you never know. That was a pitch up. a little bit. No, I think she'll be alright. Okay, for par. Okay, I'm just going to tap myself in. Got my arrow. Love this thing. Par. Okay, it is uh, currently tied at neg one. We're on hole nine, 275 feet. A little downhill. There's a stream. Another one of these tight tunnel shots. Uh, let's ace this. Nice, but I think that is not good. It's not I ideal. Out to the fairway. Should be all right. That's nice. Perfect. Okay, still almost makes it, but he'll tap in for a par. Shout out to Dan Brooks Wells. Okay, I'm currently ahead, neg one to even through the front nine. We're about to start the back nine. Um, it's a pretty, it's a nice course. It's short, well, we're going from shorts. Um, tightly wooded. 
thumb holes. Um, you have to hit your lines. Uh, you got anything to say? Uh, I'm getting hot, hungry, and thirsty. But I'm about to smash the back nine because uh, business is on because I took my sweatshirt off. <laughs>